So for anyone who doesn't know, this is not XCOM 3. This is a spin-off game set a few years after XCOM 2. You play as kind of like a special task force made up of humans and aliens and like advent rejects, like the humans are half alien or whatever. And you're basically trying to stop unrest in a very specific city. So it's not a full sequel, it cost 8 quid to pre-order, so you know, it's don't expect XCOM 3. They could be uh, trialing stuff for XCOM 3. I've only watched the uh, intro uh, preview video they did and the gameplay overview video that they did. And I can tell you right now before we get started, I despise the way they're telling the story in this one with horrible cartoon cutscenes and characters. I, I did I did bunny ears, you know, quotation marks. But doesn't matter. As long as the gameplay is good, I don't care. I will care for XCOM 3. I don't care for a spin-off game. I will, however, let the story play so that you can hear it. And we are just going to play on normal for our first game. Tutorial, yes. Subtitles, yeah. Heal between encounters, half heal. Sure. But we'll just keep it on default to get started. So let me know about the volume after the cutscene is played. The cutscene for the intro might be a bit louder. Oh god, that is loud. Alright, brace yourselves. Two minutes out. Hey, Godmother. Is this like the old days? XCOM swooping in and taking it to the bad guys? I wouldn't know. I spent most of the world training resistance networks. Like mine. And for your many long years of service. Watch it. XCOM attaches you to an untested squad and pushes it into the field before it's ready. How is this not like the old days? I'm just happy to be here. I missed out during the war. I wish I could have pulled my weight. For which side, exactly? I find that very hurtful. Sure thing, Advent. <clears throat> we are through the checkpoint. I was never actually Advent. But they were fitting you for a blocky helmet. Stow it, both of you. We're here. 3-1-PD gave us the all clear. Grab your gear and prepare to move in. What's wrong with his face, Zeppel, is that he was one of the humans getting turned into Advent, or one of the, you know, the Advent soldiers, because they were getting churned out in a factory. Whisper. what's your status? And what's Verge's ETA? So that's what's Guns wrong with working, his face. Obviously. Verge is en route. How? Verge can't drive. He, uh, he hailed the cat. To a hostage situation? Focus. Whisper, any surprises in the next room? A handful of hostiles, unaware of your approach. Chimera squad, take positions. Prep for breach. So this is the new system, this breach system, which seems quite neat. So yeah, you, you decide how you bust into play. So this is a tutorial, so it's probably going to be on like autopilot for the most part. Successful shots on enemies will crit. Okay. How do I know what classes they are? Can I? Hmm, I'm not sure I can. All oh, right, I can just I can change my mind presumably. Okay. So he's shield man. She's just like normal trooper and then where's the other one? Terminal. Oh, techie. Okay. All right, so successful shots are guaranteed crits. Let's do it. Stay behind me. Cycle through available targets with tab, left shift to use an ability. Oh, shift and tab. Okay, 100% chance, 100% chance, 100% chance, just murder him. I won't need to turn it down a bit, I think. Get right. Oh, there's still two of them, though. Hello. I am Mayor Nightingale. Is that our hostage? Welcome to City 31's Memorial Museum. She's sectoid it's or an advent. A it's hard to tell. As I often say, the lessons from our past Hello, inform the present. Blah, blah, blah. History. Focus. Oh, yeah, that's the other thing that's changed. It's no longer you go, then the enemy goes. It's, it's one each, one each. I know that from the gameplay overview as well. So hang on, I need to turn the game down just a smidge. Or actually, did anyone, like, is it too loud for you lot? It feels a bit loud for me, but that might just be my headset. Thank you, Robin, for 34 months of Twitch Prime. Thanks for continuing the great content in these difficult times and hit them in the hearty spots 34% shot chance. That'll be right. 
Right mouse to move into cover, gain line of sight to the enemy, rotate with Q and E. Yep. Oh, that's, that's very uh, quick moving. Oh look, it's one of the old invasion pods. It doesn't seem like something they should be showing off if they're trying to encourage like human alien action. So who's number two? You're number two, so you're going next. If I can kill you, you don't get a turn. Found a better position. 65%? Really? I'll oh, give it a go. Okay. So he gets a turn after her. But if he's the last one, I think she's probably safe to just walk up and blast him. Also, it's a shotgun, not a machine gun. Terrorize this. You see this? Huh. Interesting. Contact! Clear. It's a sectoid. I'm calling him Jim because I don't think I can make custom characters and I wanted a sectoid Verge? called Jim. <sighs> what took you so long? Had to unpack a breaching truck. Jim Verge. Good man. That's his name. Not exactly. You know what I mean. I always do. So creepy. Don't ever change. Verge, form up. Any hostiles in the next room? Yes. I can feel them. Oh yeah, sectoids are psychic. They reload in between encounters, it's a new era. Multiple breach points. Some encounters offer more than one breach point with different risks and benefits. Agents entering from the same breach will enter the encounter together, closer in the timeline. Okay. So the main door is closely watched and enemies do more damage. But the secondary door, last unit through this entrance does plus three damage. So someone has to go through the main door because there's not enough slots. Uh, so you've got a gun, right? Yeah, you've got a gun. Okay. I probably want the shotgun and the shield to go through the main door then and we'll have our assault rifles go through the top. Shield guy in first. Can I change the order in which this happens? Yes, I can. I would like to do that, please. Engage. We shall move in. Breaching in. Surprised. Alert. That's probably bad, huh? Surprised, alert. 50% chance? Nah, nah. A. Ooh, I did a lot of damage. Oh, of course, because it did the plus. Uh, yes. 98. Oh, aggressive. Aggressive enemies will shoot at XCOM if they aren't neutralized. Agent abilities. Each agent has a unique ability that they can use every turn, eventually gaining more abilities from their class and equipment. They also have a subdue ability, a non-lethal attack that's low damage but guaranteed to hit. Hmm. Hello, Cadandras. Or Caden Rass, perhaps? Thank you, Lojack, for 44 months with a tier 1 sub. 44 months of great games, community and content, almost 4 years. Don't remind me, I'm feeling old. Okay, so we can subdue targets, but it probably doesn't do... What has he got? Stupor. Stun the target for one, two actions. Battle Madness. Jim psionically attacks an enemy, mind making them go berserk. So who's going next? Trooper number two, you're exposed. I probably just want to shoot him then. Yeah, I think I'm just going to shoot him. That last guy is hidden, though. Uh, what is? How much damage does sub do? Two to three. Oh, someone else gets a turn after, though. So why not risk it? Sure. It's all right. You weren't supposed to hit back. Charged bash. 
charge bashes an enemy. Oh, cherub bashes an enemy. Charges consume do damage. Okay. Does that count as a... Well, even if it doesn't, I still want to see what it looks like. Book him! Book him, Dano! The Millennium was Set 20 up years ago? Shut up! I do like to make an entrance. Hello, Widow. Oh, look, it's the old loading screen from XCOM 2. Some breach points can only be accessed with special equipment or abilities. Once an agent with the required asset is in the first slot, other agents can be assigned. It's got to be a breach charge. Okay. Cherub has a breach charge. Okay. All non-aggressive enemies guarding this entrance are surprised. I guess I want my machine gun. Well, no, I probably want the shotgun first because they can take out a close target. And then rifle, rifle. You're standing a little close, aren't you? Oh, whatever. Wait, hold! Hostage confirmed in the next room. We need more than that. 3-1-PD has a live feed. Patching through. If you surrender, I will advocate leniency. Enough! This exhibit, it is about XCOM's role in our liberation. I see you read the placard. It doesn't say how they went soft and got weak. Now, it's up to us to light the spark. He's holding a detonator. Sounds like they don't no, like aliens. No. How's this for an entrance? Also, that was the next one to reference lighting the spark. That was the first mission. Okay, surprised. Surprised. Alert, but not a good chance to hit. Alert, not a good chance to hit. Alert, not a good chance to hit. Fair enough. How's that for psychic? Can you take out the alert one? 61? 61? That's not good enough. Fifty-seven, fifty-six, fifty-four. Oh, there's two over there. Um, try and f clear my right side. Good. Okay. Doesn't really matter if this guy hits or not. Then he just hit the wrong one. Oh, there's a guy at the back there. He's got again. armor, I think. I'll protect you. He hunkered. Wait, he got first turn. He did 10 damage? Oh, it's Terminal. a tutorial. Stabilize okay. him. On it. Verge, with me. Protect the mayor. Confirmed. He just will lose all their HP. Okay, so this is the new mechanic as well. Nobody can actually die. If you die, you get a game over. Well, if any of your soldiers die, you get a game over. Stabilize? Oh, no, you don't have stabilize. Oh, no, you do. Can I use it from here? No. Uh, we're getting two turns after this, so I guess. Subdue might take him out. What's the shot chance? 64 to kill? Sure. Ooh, there's the XCOM I know. He did hunker now that I think about it. Well, uh, what about a point blank shot to the face? Headed worm needed. 86? I guess that's the hunger down bonus. Now, this guy is not going to get taken down in a shot, almost certainly, so I think I'd like to do a psychic power on him, maybe? Stupor him. Hardliner. Hey, okay, he doesn't get a turn. Hello, Smash Tuba. Is this a new turn now? Yes, he's getting a turn last. Where's my ammo? Oh, down there now. Okay. Subdue him? Oh, I just got an achievement, so I already know that it worked. Cherub, are you still with us? Yeah. Uh... I don't so. think we have grenades, do we? Only thing injured is my pride. You knew that you just spam them in the early game, ribs. so they got rid of them. None of this should have happened. Most people say thank you. I'm I'm grateful, of course. 
But these people don't have the capability for any of this. Start like she killed the hostage. I read their threat assessment. A month ago, these insurgents. Oh, I didn't even realize I was the XCOM no to dispatch shit. The greatest threat they posed was to bottles of alcohol. Why tell us? Why now? City 31 shows the world how humans, hybrids, and aliens can keep a lasting peace. I'm the public face of this. Tonight, someone wanted what I represent to go up in flames. We're not in town Perhaps for they local saw your intrigue. Face. I know, but right now you're the only ones I'm certain are fighting for that same peace. Can I count on your support? Yes, ma'am. Gravely wounded. When two captured enemies, there's a 40% chance to earn 20 intel. Okay. Package delivered to 31 PD. She truly believes what she says. That's why she's in charge. Not too shabby for our first official mission. Don't do that. Don't do what? Celebrate before a mission is complete. It's... <laughs> it's bad luck. Well, she exploded. There's no customizable characters. Well, no, maybe I think robots are customizable. Tonight, Mayor Nightingale perished. But no, you have to use the people you're given. City 31's Memorial Museum. The identity of her assailants is unknown at this time. The city council asks citizens to remain. So she gets vaporized the same day XCOM sends Chimera Squad to our city. You hear that voice in your head? That's me telling you to wake up. Despite opposition. Mayor Nightingale's deciding vote brought the Reclamation Agency to the city. Without her support, Chimera Squad's continued presence is an open question. Welcome home, Chimera Squad. The director wants to speak with us. Thanks for getting the mayor killed. Also, you're fired. That's not helpful. You're right. I'm sorry. In what way did I'll we get the mayor the killed? Through we saved her. I followed Surely your it's the police that got her killed. And its aftermath. Director Kelly, I take full responsibility for what happened. Stop. I sent you to City 31 because I believed you were ready. Tonight, you surpassed my expectations. 31 PD requested help within three hours of your arrival in the city. You answered immediately. Going in, you were under-equipped and down an agent. You adapted, as we trained you to do. And let's not forget, you rescued the mayor. You delivered her to safety as the city requested. Don't blame yourself for an outcome you couldn't control. No Valen? Instead, uh, that's a definite plus let's focus point. on what's next. I set up the map table. Ready when you are. She is an alien Head sympathizer over there. after I'll all. Hold. There is a critical target waiting on the city map. Oh, so it's Thursday. Wait, is that real time? No. <laughs> it's it's not. I forgot that it's Welcome Friday. Welcome to City 31. During Advent's occupation, the city was a fortress supporting an active starport. Five years after XCOM, there probably is going to be a lot more talking. Yes, but the XCOM 2 and XCOM Enemy alike. Within are filled with cutscenes at the start as well. There's new industry, self-government, and local agriculture to support the varied populations. Against all odds, this city thrived after the war. There isn't there a shut no up Bradford mode for attacks. nothing until tonight. We don't know that, not yet, but we can find out. 3-1 PD requested our help sifting through evidence at the Memorial Museum. They lost good officers today. Give them what they need and see what we can learn. Okay, targets. We can send our squad to respond to. Come here, squad can respond to one target per day. Okay. View the situation in the downtown district. Need your help going through the aftermath of tonight's attack. Send an APC. Yeah. I think this is the other half of the tutorial. Your work with 31 PD opened a few doors. Here's what we know. A crude plasma bomb killed the mayor. The insurgents oh, had fire, no okay. access to materials for that. Does that mean they had outside help? Most likely. There are three groups in City 31 with access to this kind of ordinance. Commander, 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 oh. Choose a faction to be investigated. The target faction cannot be changed until it's resolved. Psychic humans. 
Alien scavengers. Religious nut jobs with chrysalids. I can't. What are they called? Sacred coil, I presume. All right, chat. You're going to decide for me which one we're going after. And I'm going to do it via a poll, which you can use your legitimate business points to rig if you so choose. New poll. It is only going to be a one minute poll. Which faction? The progeny. Grey. Phoenix. And sacred coil. Boom. You have one minute to make your decision. So I think everything has been streamlined, but again, I feel while this is going, just again, to remind everybody this is not a full sequel. It's a side game. It cost £8. <laughs> They're probably testing some stuff they've got planned for XCOM 3, because if I had to I'm at, like pitch XCOM 3, it's going to be Aliens and Humans versus Terror from the Deep, so I can see them like just running stuff through how people feel about it in this. Hello Vice President, just waiting for a quick poll result before we decide who we're going after. I mean we're going to have to go after all of them, it says, so it doesn't technically matter, it's just the order. Got like five seconds left. F religion. Sacred Coil won with 84% of the vote, but more importantly, did anyone rig it? Ivana rigged it with 8,500 channel points. I see. Second in was Potley Yemi, who did 4,400, and then Expo and Chuck with 200. So two people really, really wanted Sacred Coil, so there we are. Sacred Coil is what happens when former Advent officers find religion or create one. They claim to be the true path for City 31's hybrids, as long as that path involves armed sedition. Director, these are local criminals. Isn't that 31PD's jurisdiction? True. The Reclamation Agency supports local police, but we're also required to recover dangerous material. From those who would do the world harm, and each of those groups is neck deep in the stuff. So what next? Focus on a single group. Investigate, dismantle their operations, and take them down. Okay. Meanwhile, we look for any links to the mayor's death. Either way, a dangerous organization is off the streets. Exactly. The, versus the city wants Vitibus. justice for Mayor Nightingale. This is how we help them achieve it. So you do groundwork from this first mission, learn about the faction and how they operate. Operations, hidden missions that must be revealed. Some main missions, and then a takedown to kill their boss. Okay. Looks like that's the guy in the picture, honestly. Stop their final attack and end their threat. Oh, they have dark events as well. Oh, okay. Can I keep okay. Alright. You can now select an agent to add to your squad. The armory is where you manage your agents. Manage your weapons, agent abilities, if they have enough XP, biography, tint armor. Okay, so you can customize them like a teeny tiny bit. The director convinced the city Ooh. council we're too understaffed to be effective. This means we can Claymore bring more Zephyr agents Blue to City 31. He's a dual it's pistol not the user. Whole squad, not yet, but it's something. Shrapnel bomb? I mean, this is a kung fu sectoid. So I really want to take the kung fu sectoid. <laughs> I mean, what are the other ones? Like, he's just a dual pistol guy. And then this guy is, like, your heavy. AOE breaching, yeah. Close quarters, high mobility, precise shooting. So sniper, but he's using dual pistols because the sniper is less relevant in small close quarters. Okay. Kung Fu Sectoid. Zephyr, you made it. Yeah. Oh, that's you a lady. Grab a locker. Yep. Have everything you need. Yeah. Good talk. No. 
Also, she appears to be British for some reason. Okay, we don't have anything unlocked. Okay. Tint armor? Okay. We'll have her be in red because it's the color of blood. We'll have Psychic Man be Twitch Prime. We'll have Shield Man be blue. We'll have Annoying Tech be yellow. And we'll have the Commander be... Yeah, Spec Ops, black. Okay. Hey, check it out. Headquarters sent us an assembly. Assembly, with the right patterns, patterns. Okay, so it's science. Anything. Or we could with the latest version. What you're looking at is the extremely finicky 2038 model. It'll take time to stress test our patterns, but once we have them, we're good to go. Illyrium is one of three resources required. Okay. Android personnel, sure. Grants one Android tactical unit. Two days. Investigate the sacred toil for... Is that my reward or how much it costs? Presumably it's how much it costs. Credits are one of the three resources they are spent to supply our new items and upgrade existing ones. Oh no, it is the reward. Okay. The following one or more agents is idle. That, that's fine. The we are not the police. If you hmm. see a theft, call it into 3-1-PD and move on. But there is one notable exception. Hostile forces carrying dangerous contraband may attempt to flee the scene. Don't let them escape. How do I change? Ah. Can't give her anything else. Sure, we'll try this setup, see how it goes. Security camera spotted sacred coil flunkies sniffing around this warehouse. Today, the silent alarm went off. The place is full of Advent era contraband on the way to a tech vault. Some things are best left in the past. Present, uh, prevent them from escaping. Oh, there's three different ways in. First unit through this entrance gets plus one armor for the encounter. All units entering here get plus 25 aim. Last unit through the entrance will get an action point. Hmm. Oh, well, we want one of our gunners to have a. You know, we'll have him go in there. Let's have our melee person get the armor. And the better potential crit with our punch. Uh. Shield man main door with shotgun to help. Sure, let's try that. Encounter one of three. Couldn't see it because of my speaker. Go, go, go. Go, British lady, go. <laughs> Zephyr charges towards an enemy after breach sequence and attacks them with a melee strike. She will start. Zephyr will start the encounter adjacent to an enemy. Oh, it's androids? Huh. Commando. Ninety-one. Oh, it's just the one target. Okay, well. Bre bre breach fire. Bre there. Karate kick! Wait, Godmother? Oh, I guess you didn't have a shot. What does that mean? Once permission, an agent can be moved on the timeline so that it takes the next turn. This ability is shared by the entire squad. Preparation grants a defensive bonus and moves the agent next turn earlier in the timeline. Okay. Crippling Blow applies one of several debilitating effects. So that's team up. He is going to get a turn. How much is this doing? 
four to five. Oh, it's done. Oh wait, no, I didn't account for the armor. Bollocks. Oh, she has momentum. Why is she getting a turn? It still says it's Zephyr on the timeline. Oh wait, this is her free movement. That's right, I forgot she got a free movement. Maybe should have went on Overwatch. Sorry, sir. <laughs> I was just adjusting myself. Oh, he just ran away to the next encounter. Robots are cowards? Well, I guess that means they'll be more alert. Stole specialized mech parts. The kind you can't easily replicate. Advent used those mechs to sow terror. Sacred Coil may have similar plans. Keypad door. Units automatically activate Overwatch after the breach. All units that go through this entrance get plus 50 dodge. Right, oh, it's the same. We'll have Kung Fu Lady jump through the window. That is not Kung Fu Lady, my bad, you all look the same. Uh, you. Honestly, Overwatch with everybody else for the guns seems like a good idea to me. The aliens aren't people, it's fine. Time to move. Stay behind me. Also, any of you that thought she was Australian need to get your ears checked. Oh, she, he's about to get punched, so don't bother with that. The rest of the shots aren't that great. I don't care what the game says she is, I'm talking about the voice actress. She is British. That's the one that ran away. No, no cover, that'll force him to move. Locking down hostiles. He got to move before the Overwatch proc, though. They're all running. She can't reach anybody. That's a bad point of sending her that way, I guess. Oh, who are you? Uh. Is that a civilian snake? That is a civilian snake. Each time damage is blocked with a kinetic shield, chirp gains charge. Higher charge increases damage of charge bash. Damage three. Oh, that's good enough. I made the arrest. Have you arrested me? Converge successfully casts Stupor or Battle Madness enemy is added to Verge's neural network. Converge gains plus 10 aim for each enemy in the neural network. I can make it there. Oh, the first snake died. Oh well, it's just a snake. Sacred Coil is on the run. Don't lose them in the warehouse. They didn't run away though, I stopped them. Agent damage likely, agent damage likely, agent damage likely. Oh, these are negatives. Last unit through this entrance will have their weapon disabled. Oh, you get good aim if you come through here. Uh, I don't... I have to send someone through here. How do you disable a punch? I want to see a punch get disabled, because that's dumb. Reaching in! 
Breach! 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 Aggressive alert. Aggressive alert. Okay. Yeah, sure. Good damage. Oh, there's a gentleman over there, huh? Oh, hello there. I don't think she took damage there. No, she didn't. She also didn't kill it, though. So number two the robot is there. So number two robot has to die in this guy's turn. Can I just charge it? Three damage. Yes, do that. That was not a subdue, that was a murder. So now it's just him left. Is this picture on the thing meant to look like he's got a really tiny mouth and like a, a, a tiny eye as well? I believe I would just like to punch this gentleman as well, please. Hostile is under arrest. The Sectoid isn't wearing any shoes. He could get John McClane if he isn't careful. When two captured enemies, 40% chance for 20 until Due to one civilian casualty, there's a 20% chance that unrest will rise. I didn't kill the civilian though. A robot exploding killed the civilian. Five credits from the archive. Bradford. Who's Kelly? If Sacred Coil went after mechs, they need soldiers. But for what army? They were underground. The art style reminds me too much of Death Claw. election drove them to the surface. Their hatred for her gave them motive. Find out if Sacred Coil had the means to carry out an assassination. Investigation opened on the 2nd of March. An emergency oh, session on, okay. of the city council of voted 5 to 4 against the citywide curfew. Council I'm authorizing Chimera Squad Spec for special operations. Special agent duties that help Chimera Squad in the city overall. Some useful resources for the squad. Keep an oh, eye this out is like the mechanic from War of the Chosen. I've forgotten what it was called. But yeah, it's the War of the Chosen thing. Glad handing leg work Illyrium sting. So that's for money, that's for intel, and that's for Illyrium. They all take three days. I would like Illyrium, I think. Let's send her because I don't like her. She's annoying. Can I do anything here? Nope, because there's still two more days. Oh, we've got our timer. That's our lose condition right there. If anarchy, if city anarchy reaches 14, city 31 falls and XCOM will no longer remain. Fair enough. I don't think there's anything else we can do here. Couldn't I actually, can I see... Where's I want? I want this. No, this is what I want. Can I just press on someone? Yes, I can. Like, if I didn't want to take this guy, would I be able to unequip his... Yeah, I can. Okay, just... I'm taking him, but just in case I didn't want to. It looks like I can give the breaching charge to someone else. Okay, okay. Well, for YouTube, we're doing a stop and start there. But this has been the first episode of XCOM Chimera. There will be more to come. We're playing it through. Come back again probably tomorrow.